about being sensitive and that we women should be sensitive. I remember 2014 as a minister, received a call from my niece, Auntie Oye, they are insulting you on the radio, my six-year-old niece. They don't like you. Then I get another call from Mr. Letha. Where I am in a meeting. Can you call your daughter? She's panicking. She's called me in tears. She says somebody is threatening to kill you. Please, I said, I'm in a meeting. Please drop everything and call. And then my brother is like, but you two, why did you even go into all this? I'm receiving calls. I'm traveling to Kufuridia. I get a call from my cousin. Oye Mboyo, me a Kufuridia. Hey, I know here radio no bo adum 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 but we but we wahala 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 <laughs> you know and and you talked about the insults. I remember President John Dramani Mahama. One of the days uh, I had a meeting with him and he was like, "You have to have a thick skin and help build Ghana brick by brick." I have a very thick skin. You can insult from beginning of the earth to the end of the earth. Once I'm convinced I'm going this way, I'm going this way. But many others do not have that thick skin. Many other women can contribute significantly towards the development of this dear nation. But because of the insults, they just back off.